Alright everyone, and welcome back to some more Nimbotus, where once again I'm fairly excited, excited for it. It's excited. So, I selected this planet after the last video, because it has an upgrade, and I'm quite curious to see. So I have to destroy large beehives. Like, they already have a pretty effective drone, so... Well, here goes, I guess, a little bit of something, I guess. It does feel awfully quiet on my end. There we go, that's better. I also did turn down the audio because I realized how deafening it was. Oh, let's see their controls. Yep, there we go. Still have no reverse, don't need it, really. Not yet. It'd be very nice to have more storage, because I go through this fast. To say the least. Maybe not. Okay, that's quite a lot. You're going to see a lot of that here. Yeah, the electric engines are nice. I'm going to just take a guess and say they're probably not that big of a deal, but... It's a very nice calm game. Oh, There's enemies. Yes, that's what I'm doing. Go away. No, don't take out the money. Ow, 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 that is definitely warm. Flamethrowers are not terribly safe. Uh, they're fairly weak. I'm not a fan of the, uh, thing. Of the, uh, flamethrower. I'm sure if I get better upgrades on it, it's probably really good. But just the damage you can do to me, because if I catch fire, I'm pretty much over. Like, it's pretty much a run killer, so... Unless I get some coolers, which I'm pretty sure take energy, which is what it's everything I get. Oh, that's a lot of money. But yeah, unless I get something to counteract the heat damage... Um... I'm not sure how much you're gonna see of the flame for it. It does look really good, but I might go for a slightly different weapon depending on how much because like yeah it, it's quite aggressive did I seriously just no for all I can mine so would not be that bad all right I'll go back for that I suppose Yoink. a lot of space debris I don't know what for and that's magnet okay Okay, thankfully I can deal with them pretty much as fast as they go in, as fast as they can come, so... Just deal with a lot of fire damage. Now please don't touch your hive. And just like that, a nice, easy game. Oh, okay, I thought those were bugs. Uh, the fire is pretty much going to deal with them. Yeah. Stop destroying the resource which I'm here for. I'm not gonna lie, that probably does a lot of damage to me. I'm also surprised I haven't taken more power drain. You know? Hmm, we'll see by then. And I'm full again. I said, you're probably going to see a lot of this. I don't know how much resource I really want to take, so... I'm going to presume the more the merrier, yes? Let's see here. Flamethrowers do seem pretty effective. Uh, 
and that should be the planet cleared up. Do a bit of quick mining, you may want to skip ahead just a little bit. I hope you're enjoying this as much as I am. I know I'm going to spend quite a bit of it getting resources, but once I get like 2,000 beach probably, I'll probably start slowing down because I'm still, I mean the yellow is probably not nearly as valuable as red from what I can tell, but I just want to have quite a few resources to so stockpile at the start. That's how I am, I'd rather be prepared than lose a run due to a resource deficit. Which I'm pretty sure doesn't happen too often. It's probably going to be the corporation destroying birds. <coughs> so... Yeah. This has been a pretty good planet for resources. I'll definitely, once I get better sensors, probably prioritize planets with high resource densities when I'm not recording. Because I'm probably going to spend the next five minutes here. Not the best for content, but... Again, I could edit, but... Don't want to have to worry about that. So I'm not going to dig down, but I don't see the need for it right now, so... Uh, just like a lot of that. Yeah, I'm thinking going forward what I should do is just go after the red unless there's a lot of resources somewhere. Because uh, I can see how that gets tedious. Uh, oh. Speaking of a lot of red, there's a lot down here. Yeah, this is not going to be terribly good, is it? Ah, this game knows how to get me. Knows how I always go for the resources. I like how peaceful it is. You don't get that in a lot of games anymore. I'm not gonna finish that note. I have like a thousand of it already. Still could use a bit of work on the uh, control side of it. Yeah, I think I'm going to just start looking for red instead. And then Imbatus. The question is, why is there so much garbage on these planets? Okay, am I going to be able to steer this thing today? Or Ah, more resource. And not a small amount either. It's closer. Yeah, no. Engineer with its wireless transfer. If I ever see wireless transfer of resources, I'm probably going to take it for you guys. So I don't have to do this every video. I do want to try something with that. I think another thing I'm going to do is probably ignore smaller veins of ore because... Unless it's like this, there's really no reason... 
reason to try and get to it, unless it's like surface, huh? It's even still. Uh, just more resource tanks would just do the most for me, from what I can tell. Just... Ah, that's a problem. So you can grab the scrap, but why? Is it beneficial to me somehow? I don't know. I might look for a smaller piece to test. There's one. There we go. What is this? Did something. So yeah, perhaps you can recycle them, but they are kind of heavy and compared to just mining, it's... It appears to be a bit slower, so... Probably not gonna do a whole lot of that. Full again. Yeah, that's just gonna get tedious, isn't it? Alright. I'll probably only go for red now, because a thousand seems like a lot. I know red, like, what, 50, for, like, five red buys, like, 50 yellow. So. Oh, you can actually go in. That could possibly be useful, honestly. If you did it right. Like you're getting swarmed, just hide in the bin, maybe? Yeah, magnet's fun, but it seems unreliable. Yeah, no, I think it is literally just garbage. Planets in episode, that's not gonna be too entertaining. There we go. Weapon upgrade, so way more power consumption, but it should be very effective. So there's some shops around, there are heaters, as if I don't have enough heat on this vehicle. Uh, these are, what, flippers? Mm. That looks good, because it just sort of gives mineral rewards. And then perhaps I can visit the shops, so let's go. What are you? G'day. I, if the corporation comes, that's pretty much just a plus. It's 50 instead of 20, so. I don't really want to get them on my bad side. Also, you know, I'll collect. So like I've just done. I really wouldn't know why they're so angry about my mere presence here. But, well. 
I mean, if they're really mad about me taking their things, then perhaps they're just really bad at their job. Ooh, okay. That front got a little crispy. Now you guys would probably be completely fine if I lost my ability to get resources after that last one. Continuing on! Now where are... I feel like the fossils would be buried, but then again... I would not know. That's a fossil. I'd rather be looking for one that's on the other side of the planet, but... You know, that is good to know what they look like. Reminds me of the, uh... Fossil in Deep Rock. Just a little shell. Showing off weird particle effects, I guess they kind of all are. Hmm. Alright. Over again because I didn't put the thrusters in well. So pretty much nothing here. Stop. I don't know if these plants are just really small or if these drones are just really big. Something tells me I don't think I'd like to answer either way. center of the planet here faster than approaching another fossil. I guess maybe there is only one fossil and I just have to find it. Yeah, I guess I drilled to the center of the planet just now. Oh well. Again, this planet is not massive. Hmm. Well, I might as well grab the fossil and go. But yeah, once in testing, I have completely incinerated my ship with the flamethrowers, so that's why you see me being all nervous about them, like, oh, I don't want to burn myself up. It's because I've done it before, and I'm like, eh, that's not great. I'm actually not sure if this drone can pick it up. It should, but again, I don't really know how much it needs me to pick up, so... Yeah. I didn't think that through, did I? If I melt the fossil, I lose, basically. Okay. Nothing seems to be burning, so... I don't know how I'm supposed to grab it. Alright. 
a much faster, hello, much easier mission. And now just a lot of money, so I guess yeah, it is kind of worth it. There's a shop there, and there's a garage here. Part of me wants to go and get these heaters before I go here and here. Although I have a feeling heaters will be a reoccurring thing. Uh, and you are springs. Oh, energy shields. Yeah, I'm probably gonna go for that. What's in the garage? Let's try. Alright. That was quiet. Oh. So 70, which is more than I was expecting. To 200. That's still not that good. I have a lot more of that. Kinda want more sensors. Increase the amount of drone parts that can be deployed for free. That sounds good, but. C plus one systems further. Don't need. Stealth seems good because it's just overall cheaper. Increase deployment cost for a drone part from five to four. I think I'm just gonna max out the sensors so I stop placing it once time. Fabrication seems pretty good. I'll take a little stealth, and I think I'm just gonna leave the Nimbatus as it is. That's not too good. Honestly, drone parts is good, and fabrication is good. Just let me see uh, if I think it's in hangar. How many parts are on my drone? How many parts? Sixteen, okay, well... Makes a very minuscule difference to me, honestly. So yes, I got upgrades, now I want to try this place. Although I have a feeling we're going to meet our best friend pretty soon. Sell on Obtanium, so that's what I was thinking of. Small batteries, oh, it's a literal shop. Coolers, now I'm thinking about these. Uh, they're expensive, and I just spent a lot of money. I don't seem to need batteries. Plasma guns. And then cryo shotguns. Shotguns seem pretty good. Plasma blasters seem fine. I think I'm gonna take those. Take these, maybe. I don't think the small batteries are too good. For what I'm going for. Uh, I'm probably not going to use those yet. I could just leave and reset the fret. Unless it's a really good deal here, like the shield. Oh, they're going to hate me for this. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, and we're taking out a transmitter. Well. They love me. <laughs> They will want to destroy their transmitter. Ah, it's purple! There appears to be massive planetary caves. There is massive planetary caves. Imagine having a faster creation and crashing and burning in here. Yeah, that's right. I should probably get my friend to do that. Who's actually, like, pretty good at flying games because... Oh, the entire planet's revealed to me. Oh, I just realized I'm notching my own creation doing that. Okay, this is more dangerous. It's very small in here. I want to get a switch as well for, like, coolers and shields. Wow, how ironic I'm going for shields right now. Uh... That is a gun. No. Quickly. Counter it. Thankfully, guns are only as smart as you being in their line of sight, so. Whoa. <laughs> My friend, your friendly 
firing. A lot. What's wrong with you? Guys, yeah, focus fire. How am I still okay? Do you think they're questioning why their signal's flickering on and off? I doubt it. Uh, I think they took my vacuum. Uh, that's a shame. Give me your thing then. <laughs> Wahaha! Don't you even think about it. Boom. They love me. <laughs> I and mean, if you were the corp, wouldn't you be happy for some random guy with a drone to blow up your thing? I don't need the resources. And now I have the shields. Brilliant. Don't want to travel. Yeah, I'm not too sure how to check the resources on a planet. Well, time to leave. What? I'm leaving. Ow. Corp has caught up to an open fire. A few shots hit. You manage to... Uh, you manage to penetrate the hull. Right. You fired one shot, pal. You manage to escape once more from the enormous ship. Let's say to you for now. Well, it's time to reset that. You approach a wormhole. You spot some debris orbiting. You can probably grab a piece before they get sucked in. There's a hull and take your heat point by one. This is literally a better deal. I can't take that. Well, this is a hundred, that's eighty, and that's seventy. And I want this. Regardless. I mean, you're basically handing it literally did hand it to me. <gasps> I caught that too? Yay! Wait, it didn't forget about me. I can go back. Hold on. Maybe. Okay, we got garage. Common weapons. Uh, capacitor, but uh, I don't see the point in that, honestly. What? Retrieve the freezer, a frozen planet. I don't have heaters. It's definitely colder. It's literally TNT. Love that. Oh, this place is massive. I want to check that out eventually. Oh, I can't even see what they are then. Okay, so that's what the bridge upgrades do. I might just check out the garage before just obtaining the common weapons. I guess that's not gonna work. Just realize what I've done. More energy shields. I want to pick those up. Um, it's if enemy is less damage. I'm gonna pass. Uh, it's just hard for me to resist, because I only really want four small energy shields, and now I'm done. Uh, I'm sure the freezer sounds like it's out of my range. Or not. Alright, wish, wish me luck. Uh, I do believe I got stealth. Whoa. There's definitely a lot that's changed. That looks impressive. Let's see if I can remember the weapon workshop. Whoa. More elemental. 
more direct, more digging. Uh, recoil downgrade, further accuracy downgrade, and upgrades to both of those. And the joint ones, which is incompatible. I see. I can increase the bullet count, so there's now two of those. Yes, why not? So <laughs> now it fires twice as much. And you can just sort of research it. Some more of that heat seeking, seriously. It's straight up just homing if you get enough. <laughs> homing sounds really good. I use in DRG, as I said before, I, I used a lock E1 or a you know, lock on one. Uh, take a guess how nice it is when I have to aim. Just saying. Lifetime. So that plus digging is probably good on the flamethrower. Again. This is definitely a lot more expensive, but I mean, come on, it, it's a minigun, right? Oh, it's a rocket launcher. Uh, that's not what I meant to click. It also appears I'm out of time for today. Woo, rockets. Yeah, I do want to use those, but I don't think I'm going to. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. It appears I've wasted all of my time. And yes, I'm gonna phrase it like that. No, you cannot convince me. But yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. And, um, yeah. That's just right up there. I'm dumb. Until next video. Wait, where did I get heaters? Uh, that would make the mission easier. But to Wait, how do I turn on the heaters? Mm -hmm. Yes, it appears I didn't think far. Uh, it's easier. Radius. Wait, one of these could take the entire vehicle. Wait, that's great. It's probably quite expensive, but it's cheap. Strength. I don't know exactly what to do with that. Well, that's gonna be complicated for me to understand. Well, thank you all so much for watching, and until the next one, see ya.